So in order to do this, I get to give you a quick little lesson on acids and bases. So I just have some water inside. We're on a magnetic stirrer, so we can kind of mix it around. Yeah, uh, you remember that we've used cabbage juice in the past. So you take a cabbage leaf and you boil it and you extract right. the cabbage juice. Right. This is similar to that. It's called a universal indicator. It's the same thing that a chemistry teacher would use. So this uh, particular indicator will change if there's an acid or a base. So for example, if I squeeze in a little of an acid, watch the color change that you see there. See oh, how it sure changes enough? color? Yeah. Oh, cool. So it yes. goes red when it's wow. an acid and it turns back to blue when it's base, a oh, little bit darker blue. Look so we can that. kind of take it back that way. So it's it's kind of greenish blue that Chemistry. Way. Is that kind of fun chemistry that in action? Is. All right. Yes. So uh, here's what we're going to do is to that pot, I'm going to add some milk and magnesia. All right. It's actually called magnesium hydroxide. So this is going to go inside. So here's our milk and magnesia. So this is exactly what Purple. this stuff does in your <laughs> stomach because it's going to help Coats neutralize the stomach your stomach. And neutralizes yeah. the acid. Right. So let's uh, let's simulate the uh, the acid going into your stomach or stomach acids. So this is a little bit of vinegar. So I'm just using vinegar. Okay. All right, so in the pot, water, and a little of the indicator in the milk of magnesia. Watch what happens. We're going to add some. So watch what happens to your stomach. It turns oh, acidic. Six. But now watch what the milk of magnesia does. It starts to work. And as it starts to work, you start to see those color changes. Oh, and Seven, that's what milk of magnesia I'll does. Be so that darned. magnesium hydroxide gets used up. And so now it's neutralizing your stomach. Does it so work that fast it again. in your stomach? Well, I don't know. I mean, in the demonstration, you know, so you can see it right away. I, I don't know uh, look what we'll have that. to look at. That, that and ask is the doctors. amazing. But isn't Boy, that amazing? It's, it's, it's just potent, real. isn't it? It wow. is. And we're using up that magnesium hydroxide right now, but I think it's a great way to be able to show kids what an antacid is all about. It really tries to neutralize your stomach. See how it just keeps on that taking it back? That is very cool. Oh, that, that is back. a great uh, isn't that school a fun science uh, yeah, explainer. Isn't that a great you know? one? That is and a good one. for a science fair project, you just simply test the different antacids and see how fast they go back. And they can get these chemicals. These are commercially available chemicals. Yeah, so we're just using cabbage juice indicator, milk and magnesia, and you could use a little bit of vinegar, and you've got it.